Vibes. It is smooth live time. We are back with the day, guys. We are back with a banger today, you guys. How much smooth life is there? Y'all been doing good? I've been doing good to you guys. Hey, so today I'm gonna give y'all a walk around of my Camaro Z01. Fresh, freshly wrapped, modded on the 85. All that good stuff for you guys. So let's get right into it. Okay, so we're gonna be going over my car and walking around my Z01, like I said. Hopefully the cars in the background aren't too much. But also, if you're new here, go ahead and subscribe to the channel, join the Smooth Life for Gaming, and hit that sub button, you feel me? Hit that, that bell every, to get notification every time I drop a video, you guys. Yes, yeah, sir, join the Smooth Life for Gaming so you can get all the nice videos and all the crazy stuff I do with this car this coming up summer. It's gonna be crazy. But first of all, let's start with the more noticeable thing. The fade from black to green wrap that I have on my Z01. Hopefully my shadow's not in the way, but this is a one of one never done, never seen before on a Camaro Z01 ever. So if you're watching this video, you're witnessing a one of one wrap on the Camaro Z01. Let's see, so we have to fade from black to like a, a purplish to a dark green, getting lighter to light. It doesn't really get to the full green to like right here, as you can see. So, I, but yep, it is a fade from black to green. That is the first thing. Well, this is the last, this is the latest thing I've done to my car, but that's the first thing I'm showing you guys. We have plans to add some green throughout the car. We added the Smooth Life tie banners on there, you feel me? So people know who's riding around when they see it because people do break their necks when they see this car. It's hilarious, it's like I'm driving around in a supercar. It's so hilarious. People be like, what the heck? You get the thumbs up, you get the... I had a lady scream with two arms like, oh my God. <laughs> so it's hilarious, you guys. And yes, so we have that. Let's also give you guys a walk around of mine. I, I like to show these off, my tail lights. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm back, jumping back and forth. The back of the wrap is my favorite part. Hopefully the sun doesn't mess it up because we have, I opted to get this wrapped in black, mainly because it gives it like a two-tone look in the back. Match the black tips and all that. And we did do 3M striping, uh, 3M uh, reflective striping all over the car on the we did three of them striping on the body kit of the car. So the front splitter, the side skirts, and the rear diffuser, and it all is reflective. I'll give you guys a look right now. But yeah, <laughs> it looks so menacing in the front. It's like business in the front, slime in the back, you feel me? <laughs> the party is in the back, you guys. But the tail lights too are my favorite part about this car. So these are sequential. So these do like right, little little left, right, little left. I don't know if you guys ever seen that, but let me let me put it on for you guys. So look, <laughs> you feel me? So yeah, I wasn't I wasn't joking. I was, I was serious. They do that. I wasn't playing around. But yeah. So, tail lights, wrap, one oil wrap, <laughs> 3M striping. Now let's get to some mods that I got on this car. So let's pop the hood and get a bunny there. And this ain't no SS with no Z01 body kit. This ain't no SS with a, a LT4 blower on This is a LT4, what is it, Forge Piston and Rods that come from factory. Let's see if I can open this up with one hand. So, Engine Bay is not the prettiest. It's been driven, it's been raced, it's been all that stuff. Actually, no, it's been lightly driven. No hard miles. It's for sale, actually. <laughs> nah, I'm joking, I'm joking. But, so the car does come with a, a, a 1.7 liter blower. If you guys don't know about Z01's and the LT4 system. So 1.7 liter Eaton blower. I do have a strut brace on here. It looks good. I may end up taking it off sooner or later, though, but it looks good. We have a expansion tank. For my coolant so it burps supercharged i don't have to bleed it manually every other week when i'm racing i don't have to worry about having air in my system 
which and your system pulls timing which lowers your horsepower output so you when you see a z1 getting walked by a hellcat or even close to a scat pack or a, a 5.0 that's why they don't want to tell you that i don't want to be the <laughs> the father of excuses but some people don't know that just to let you guys know but back to the real you feel me we have a roto fab this is the normal roto fab intake this is not the big gold this is the regular roto fab yeah which is not really a big difference between that unless you're like heads cam ported throttle body or bigger one or three millimeter throttle body which i have all that coming in the future for you guys you see we have our stock headers our stock uh, shorties but i do have a primary cat delete that's why the car is so loud but also if you look back there, duck back there, I do have my flex fuel sensor hidden, hidden, just to make the engine bay look a lot cleaner. But we all on we all on, uh, E E35. This mix between 93 and E85. So yeah, 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 yeah. And this, I guess these, this is the recipe. If you want to get 600 wheel, 610 wheel, the I wouldn't say the cheapest way, but the less abrasive way. I am getting headers. They're coming in soon. <laughs> I, I, I'm getting headers out. I just didn't get headers the first time because I, I didn't want to really mod mod the car. But now that I already done got it, Cat Delete E32 and intake, car makes 600 wheel, like 600 wheel for real. Just off of that little bit of stuff. So might as well go headers, port my blower, upper pulley, and all that stuff, which is in the making. I just gave you guys a secret on what I'm doing with my car. But yeah, since I showed you guys the Cat Delete, how about we hear the exhaust? Because it is a Cat Delete. But it also has, it could be dirty back here. This is an AWE trap cat back. So, let's see if I can put my flash on it. Ah, uh, it says AWE on it. I gotta turn the car around for you guys to see. But it is an AWE cat, cat back from the cat delete back. So it is fully straight pipes, no resonators, no mufflers, no none of that stuff. So it is extremely loud. And I get a lot of compliments. People say it sounds like a fully blown race car. And I said, I don't even have headers on the car yet. It's still the stock shorties. But I was told the stock shorties flow pretty well from uh, one of the guys at a uh, performance shop in, in Kansas City, uh, Killer Performance. He said, yeah, the, the stock uh, manifolds flow pre pretty well. People, twin turbos, the ones that keep the, well, the guy, the owner of the shop. <laughs> if you ever heard of Stain Killer, the guy with the twin turbo orange Z01, Nemo. He has a whole bunch of other stuff. He has a twin turbo R8 too, but. I guess he kept his stock shorties. He's the owner of Killer Performance and he's the only person I've seen to do that. And they say the stock manifolds flow pretty well. But we're gonna get headed just to get that extra bump. And it's more efficient horsepower with lower boost. So, cause it drops like a pound of boost, I think when you add headers to the car. But let's listen to it. <laughs> cause I'm doing a lot of talking. I know you guys wanna hear how crazy this thing sounds. I get a 90 decibel reading when I read the car from my Apple Watch. But yeah, that's a smooth walk around. I'm, I'm gonna put some clips in the, in the, of, of the car, like, like in action, racing people and all that stuff. But yeah, man, this is my Camaro Z01. I never gave my viewers a walk around of the car. I know this is a quick and not too in detail video, but I kind of gave you guys my mods, what I've done to it. Oh, I forgot to tell you, this is the best tire. I'm going this side. If you get, a, if you got a 500, matter of fact, when I was, yeah, when I, my car was 500 wheel, I struggled with traction. If you have a 550 plus wheel horsepower car, these tires are gonna be your best friend. Nitto NT555R2s. These are the radio version of the G2s. G2s are trash. G2s are trash, they're garbage, they're booty meat. Booty meat. Get the R2s. I struggle hooking under 30, but like 35, 40, 40 rolls, 40 rolls and up. We hooking, we hook, we hook and book.
kind of hard. It has to be warm outside on the prep track, but 40 rows and up, we hook and book, you guys. So, yeah. <laughs> Tires are essential in a car like this. Tires are a essential, needed. Fronts have all seasons because it was below freezing. But I got to change this to some more, a more aggressive front tire also. But can't forget the carbon fiber. Carbon, chipping fiber. Let's see if this is better. Chipping fiber. Chipping fiber on the hood. You know, this the hood and Chipping fiber. <laughs> chipping fiber. <laughs> <laughs> carbon fiber carbon fiber and also I guess I can show you guys some interior bits so I've been lackluster on showing you guys interior red seat belts mandatory come on man stop playing red seat belts for the boy man big it ain't fully bloody guts but this is like a, a vein a bloody vein type shit Recaro seats if you guys don't know what come with the Z01s Recaro seats heated and cooled heated and cooled steering wheel Alcantara steering wheel I have to re-knit it I haven't had time, it's been cold outside. I don't really drive this car that much. Let me open this up. We do have a sunroof. <laughs> that allows us to record this in here. But we added some carbon on the steering wheel, you see? By that Z01 on the side, things on the middle, around the Camaro. -y. I'm debating if I want to add more carbon in here. Back seat's not functional at all. I usually take them out. This glows up at night. This is ambient lint also, and we have lights throughout the whole car. So, yeah. That is Shigo. The new name I made for my Z01 is not Big Blizz anymore. She's not white anymore. She's black and green. Big Shigo for the win. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed that and enjoyed the tail lights, <laughs> I'm showing the, the thing is going a little, little left and we're, we're right. You feel me? You guys seen that TikTok. But yep, yeah, if you enjoyed seeing this car more and more, I'm going to be posting a lot more. It's starting to get warm around the Midwest now, so I can try to put, put three videos out a week for you guys. But yeah, if you're in the viewer, go subscribe to the channel on the Smooth Light Game. Hope you enjoyed this thing, man. Because this is my baby. I still want to see 70 60. But hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. You feel me? Join the Smooth Light Game. But y'all know the vibe. Smooth Lata is out.